Good morning. This is Buckeye Gordon. Um, I was reading or drinking my coffee this morning, and uh, I remember an event in my life. Um, I grew up, we grew up poor. We didn't really have much money, if any. Uh, for a while there, when I was six, seven years old, we were homeless. We lived in a car. But once we got a place to live, I remember my dad, when he had coffee, we couldn't even afford coffee, but mom somehow made that happen for him. And uh, But what she would do is once the coffee was made, she would take the grounds out and uh, keep it open so that the grounds would dry up. And the reason for that was she could make it again the next morning. Um, you know, I, I can only imagine what that tastes like. It's probably pretty weak, but if that's all you have, that's all you have. Also, cigarettes were pretty expensive. My dad was a heavy smoker. And I can remember him buying uh, this kit. Um, the tobacco came in a, like a tin can, not very big, kind of small, and, and had papers. And uh, if you're old enough, or you probably realize what he did, he would he would roll his own his own cigarettes. And uh, it just goes to show what people will do with very little money uh, to survive. Uh, we didn't get much to eat. I can remember my mom, we had a large family, my mom peeling a 10 pound bag of potatoes and she would put them all in three cast iron skillets. And uh, she would fry those up for us. I was telling that to, uh, to a customer where I work they were about my age, maybe a little bit older. And uh, they too had a large family and talked about what their mom and dad went through. And I just kind of let a little bit out of what my parents went through without going into to a lot of detail. But uh, I just hadn't thought about that when I was drinking coffee this morning and just thought I'd share it. I want to let you know, I know a couple that uh, were in their early 80s and they lost a, a baby girl when they were younger through sudden infant death syndrome, SIDS. And the mother uh, wrote a book and the book is entitled Angel on Our Bedpost. And I'm going to be reading from this probably three times a week, two or three times a week. Uh, it's a very good book, very well written. It talks about the happiness and excitement of having a baby. It also talks about the anguish, the heart broken of losing the baby. Something I'd never want to experience. I have two grown adult kids and I I, I don't want to experience that like you don't want to, I'm sure. So I would ask that you subscribe 
so you don't miss uh, the reading from this book. It's a very good book. It's not very big. Um, it only has 60, 48 pages, I'm sorry, 48 pages, and I'll be reading a chapter each time I do a video. So if you would, please subscribe. Hit that subscribe button, hit the bell, and click all. Also, give this video a like, even if you don't like it, but you might think somebody else might benefit like it and that way YouTube will push it out to more people and uh, I think that's one of the reasons why we were put on this earth is to help others and that's that's why I do videos I'm not monetized I don't really care about that I just want to help other people as much as I can my videos are generally about my growing up as a poor boy uh, my experiences as an army soldier and uh, being a veteran, uh, I'll be talking about the uh, VA health care soon. So like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, my friends, have a wonderful day.